Okay, several of you have asked for a video on explaining the keyboard shortcut commands. Uh, the keyboard shortcut commands I'm using aren't matching the default keyboard shortcut commands, shortcut commands that those of you on laptops have. And I want to show you how to change those. If I go to simple entry, and I go to simple and I go to simple entry options I can then edit the keyboard shortcuts and I can put in my custom commands that I want I can change anything I want to so by default for the note to be a 64th it's one Mine will, says, mine will have the numbers. I guess some of yours were having alt and the numbers. So I've been able to set this up like it would be set up on the desktop that I was trained finale on years and years and years ago. So I was able to put in my own shortcut keys and you can do the same. So if I want to put an interval of a fourth above, I use command and four. Also somewhere in here is to put that same interval in below. You can see obviously to put in an A, I'm going to hit A and B and B and so forth. If I'm adding that letter, I can hit Shift and that letter and it'll add it as well. There's my below. I have my below to be Shift and that number to put that interval in below the note that I put in. So command above, shift below. But the biggest one, I think, um, you guys were having to hit alt. And I just hit the, the number. And there are different default sets. There's a laptop shortcut table and a default shortcut table. That's the biggest thing. I just um, do the default rather than the laptop. The laptop doesn't have the number pad that the default has. So as a result, the shortcut keys are different. So I hope that helps. You can edit yours anytime you want. Let me know if you have more questions.